Hey everyone, how's it going? Kim here, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna go through a 20 minute all standing, no repeat hit with weights. Today's format is going to be a 45 second work with a 15 second rest and all you're gonna need is a set of dumbbells. We're gonna start with our warm up and finish with an all standing post workout stretch. Go ahead, get yourself all set up and when you're ready, we'll get started. Okay, let's warm it up. Let's take those arms big and wide, then pull the elbows back. Good, stretch out the chest, then engage the back. Big breath in, exhale. One more just like that. Good, we're gonna hinge it forward, come down, touch our toes, lift, and bring a knee up. Good, hinging here, it's okay if your knees are bent. Pull that knee in. One more each side. Let's plant those feet close together. Bring your arms forward. We're gonna turn and twist behind us and bring it center. Getting a nice rotation in through that waist. Big inhale, exhale. Last two. And one, good work. Let's take those feet out wide and bring the heels up. We're gonna add some bicep curls right here. Really try to think about driving that heel up to meet your glutes, stretching out through your quads, activating those hamstrings. We're gonna keep those feet wide in four, Three, good. Feet are nice and wide, hinge and cross, touching the opposite side. Good, last two. We're gonna step it in right here and circle out those arms for eight. Four. And one, we're gonna do some ankle taps here. So we're bringing it up, tapping with our fingers. Good. Add one, shake out everything. Let's grab a set of weights. Now I'm gonna go a bit light on this. So for a reference, I'm using a set of 10s. We're gonna take it out to a side squat. Swing the weights up. Side squat, swing the weights up. You can go single weight. And if you don't like squatting, just step out and swing. All right, so you don't have to bend the knees. We're going in about five seconds. Shake out those arms. Good, big step to the side and swing. 45 seconds. Good, drop down one weight. Again, knee friendly. You're just gonna have your feet wide. You're gonna come down and high pull. Or you're going to bend that knee, lift high pull. We're gonna stay on one side. 
here we go. High pull, cross. It's already getting up there. How are you doing? <sighs> Remember, bend or straight leg, but nice and strong through your core. Here we go. Nice job. Okay, pick up your second weight. We're gonna go into some alternating presses. So arms are by your side, wrist pointing away from you. Slight bend in the knee, you're gonna press, press. Inhale, here we go, press. Feeling that in my shoulders. How are you doing? Keep it going. You got four, three. And rest, single dumbbell. We're gonna work one knee at a time. We're gonna do some knee drives. With one weight, you're gonna drive that knee up and back. All right, arms are up overhead. Here we go, knee drive, out. If your shoulders are getting tired, hold your weight here. Good. And just do a little crunch. Your choice. Take out those shoulders. Get a shoulder break right after this. <sighs> nice deep breath in, arm up or at your chest. Here we go. work. I'm going to go a little heavier. We're going to do a deadlift to a lunge. If you don't want to lunge, just stick with the deadlifts. All right, so suitcase deadlift. Weights are at our side. Belly nice and strong. 
You're gonna hinge forward, squeeze, and lunge, or just stick with the deadlifts. Nice work. Take it back to a single dumbbell. Again, fairly light. We're gonna take it to the corner. Press, press, center, press, press, center. Make sure you're pivoting up on that toe. Good, to the side, press, press, center. Good. Nice job, grab a second dumbbell. We're gonna do a sumo squat, or you can do a sumo deadlift. So deadlift, you're hinging here. Squat, you're gonna bend the knees. Then we're gonna do a bicep curl. So wrist pointing out, down, and curl. That option is a hinge instead of a bend through the knees, and lift, curl. Good, squat if you like. Stick with those weights. We're gonna hinge forward. We're gonna do an alternating high row. So your wrists are pointing towards you. You're hinging towards the floor. And we're gonna be pulling that weight up to meet our chest. Elbow out to the side, alternating sides. Here we go, pull that belly in. Good job, okay, knee friendly. If you wanna go knee friendly, you're just gonna do a leg abduction. So you're just gonna take that leg out to the side. Okay, otherwise, I'm gonna come into a curtsy lunge out to the side, sticking to one side. Weight's just there for a little resistance. Good. Shake it out, we gotta do the other side. We have two moves to go. So we're gonna do this side, then we have one more exercise. Nice deep breath in, holding that weight at your chest. We go in three.
final move. Feet out wide. We're going to bob and weave, press it out. Or you can just hinge down, slight bend in the knee, press. Good, get low, up, press it out. Press. standing cool down stretch let's go ahead drop your weights grab some water if you want some water and then just move that body nice and slow shake out those arms you did great all right nice deep breath in through your nose and exhale good listen to your body you stay in your cool down as long as you need to to get that heart rate down big breath up Get nice and tall. Just sway those hips side to side. See if you can recognize any tightness throughout the body. And as you exhale, let that go. Inhale, reach. Exhale, down. Let's grab onto our elbows behind our back. Or if you can't reach your elbows, just grab onto your hands. We just want to open up through that chest. Stretch out the shoulders a little bit. Good. Look over one shoulder and drop your chin. Take it over to the other side. Nice work. And release those arms. We're going to place our hands on our thighs. Come on down. Tuck that tailbone down and under. Arch through your back. Bring your chin to your chest. Come to a nice straight back. Slide it down. Again, if you have bent knees, don't worry about it. Work with your mobility and then just hang it down. <laughs> We're gonna lift with a nice straight back, shoulders back and down. We're gonna grab onto one foot and come into a quad stretch. This stretch doesn't work for you. If you have a chair nearby, just place that leg on your chair, tuck that tailbone down and under, push your hips forward. Get that quad stretch. Good. We're gonna bring that leg on front and just hold it here. Opening up through that hip. A little bit of a stretch in through the glutes there. release it down. Let's do the other side. Good. Cross that leg over top. Oh, balance. Nice work. Let's finish with our legs nice and wide. Hinge it forward, take it to one side. Nice deep breath in. And over to the other side. Deep breath in. Bring it center. Good, walk those feet in. We're gonna roll it up nice and slow. Bring those shoulders up to meet your ears. Roll them back and down. You did it, great job guys. I hope you enjoyed that workout. You take care and I'll see you on the next one.